Garçon's disused railway station has been abandoned for years and it doesn't look like it will be coming back into operation anytime soon. Little by little, production and cultivation in the village slowed down to the point where they sometimes even ground to a halt, as most residents moved away looking for better opportunities elsewhere. It got to the point where there was nothing in the village and people felt they had no future. Then suddenly things started to take off and it changed everything here. It was less than 10 years ago that the village began to enjoy this new lease of life, thanks to the fact it had become so deserted. It's impressively quiet. It's like any other village in South America, but it has a touch of class. All the more so thanks to the fact renowned Argentine chef Francis Malman has opened an exclusive restaurant in the village, attracting a certain clientele. We serve up typical Argentine dishes, so it's like having a little Argentina here in Uruguay. Most tourists come here to escape the hustle and bustle of Uruguay's busy summer beaches. And although most only visit for the day, overnight accommodation is starting to become an option. This property, for example, is open when its British owner is not at home. Most local residents welcome the change in the village, although some fear it could go too far. We are a bit worried sometimes. We don't want to lose the quiet life we currently have. Many more have recently decided to sell up, tempted by the high value of their homes. Others wonder what the future holds for the village, hoping that despite the changes, it won't lose its charm.